Hi there, my name is Gardner Hansen, and I'm part of the City of Parksville's Aquastar team. Today we're going to tell you a bit about your water source. The City of Parksville draws its water from two separate sources. One is the Englishman River, the other is a series of 18 wells located primarily along the southern edges of the city. Together, these two sources provide the City of Parksville's residents with about 1.8 billion liters of water in 2009. So here we are. So we typically draw water from the Englishman River during the summer and the fall months. This in large part is due to the fact that the Englishman River is too turbid to use during the winter and the spring months. During the winter and spring months we primarily draw from our groundwater aquifers and our wells and our pump systems. This all contributes to the City of Parksville's water distribution system that you utilize year round. So on average, we use the Englishman River and our groundwater system about 50-50 each year. In actual fact, this actually creates a nice equilibrium due to the fact that we don't want to put too much demand pressure on our groundwater aquifers and allow them decent time to recharge. How do we draw the water from these two sources? Good question. When we draw water from the Englishman River, we draw from a large intake located downstream from the Orange Bridge. From there, the water is treated and disinfected to BHA standards before it is entered into our general water distribution system. Currently, there are 24 active water licenses on the Englishman River. So originally, the reason for the Aerosmith Lake Dam is to create additional water storage. When it came time to plan for future water needs, all the existing water licenses were used up. No more water licenses were to be issued without creating capacity for future consumption and fisheries benefits. The Aerosmith Lake Dam came to be as part of a joint venture agreement between the City of Parksville, the Regional District of Nanaimo, and the Town of Qualicum Beach. Together, this venture agreement came to be known as the AWS, the Aerosmith Water Service. The City of Parksville roughly owns 64%, the Regional District of Nanaimo roughly owns 22%, and the Town of Qualicum Beach roughly owns 14%. The dam was commissioned in 2000 and has a capacity of 9 million cubic meters of water. The dam is what allows us to continue to consume water from the river during the summer months and provide flow requirements for fish habitat. As for the 18 wells that the City of Parksville utilizes, they are either located at the Springwood Park or near the Via Rail Station lands. Also, the City of Parksville has reservoir capacity of 10.5 million liters of water. Beyond our two water sources, the City has a very complex water distribution system. It is comprised of over 95 kilometers of piping, five reservoirs, different pump stations around the town, high and low pressure zones, computer controlled monitoring systems, and it connects to over 4,500 properties within the city of Parksville. You may also be wondering how this complex system is all controlled and monitored. Another good question. Overall, the city's water distribution system is controlled and monitored daily by a group of dedicated employees within the city of Parksville's operations department and a computer system called SCADA. SCADA means Supervisory Control and Data Acquisition and helps us immensely in monitoring the system's daily needs. SCADA also helps us at times determine how much water we're withdrawing or diverting from our different water sources at any given time. In addition, it can also look at the on-off status of pumps, the flow level of pumps, our system pressure, monitor chlorine residuals, and even look at our reservoir levels. As you can see, SCADA is a very beneficial tool that we have been utilizing here within the City of Parksville for some time now. The SCADA system itself is located at the Public Works Department and monitored daily by our dedicated trained staff. So that's a quick look at your water source, Parksville. If you have any further questions, please feel free to contact us at the City or you can go to our website at parksville.ca or parksvilleaquastar.ca for further information. Thanks.